Thousands of people have been evacuated from the town of Los Alamos, where a wildfire has consumed more than 61,000 acres of land. And it's just a few miles from the Los Alamos National Laboratory. As fire crews battle the flames, there are concerns over the safety of nuclear and hazardous materials stored on that site. If the fire actually reaches the site, temperatures will rise because these sites are above ground. The cans could pop open and liquids and solids could then be lofted into the air containing plutonium dioxide dust, one of the most toxic chemicals known to science. The fire chief assured the public that those barrels are secure. It's not high level what rad waste and we believe that we can protect those, we can foam them if in fact they do catch fire. They have vents in them. They'll vent in it with a HEPA filter and there'll be no release of any toxic materials. Authorities say they are watching the situation closely and measures are in place for monitoring air quality. Water tanks on the lab's property have been refilled as firefighting measures continue and the lab will remain closed through Thursday. Reporting from Washington, I'm Holly Furfer.